What if I told you there's secret messages all around us, inside images, audio files, and even web links? In this video, we're going to break down how hackers, cybersecurity pros, hide information in plain sight. We're talking base64, ciphers, steganometry, binary, and even more, with examples that anyone can understand. Let's start with something simple, encoding. Encoding is not encryption. It does not need a key. It just transforms data to make it harder to spot. Now let's talk about some of these formats. Base64 turns binary into readable text using 64 characters. For example, the word hello becomes this in Base64. You'll find this in email attachments, web tokens like JWT, and obfuscated scripts. Hexadecimal is how machines see memory. It's Base16 uses 0 to 9 and A to F. The word high becomes 68 69 in hex. You'll see it in memory dumps, malware forensic, and file headers. URL encoding replaces symbols with percent signs in hex codes. Uh, look at the example below. These are used in phishing URLs, redirect traps, and web exploits. Now let's talk about ciphers. This shifts or scrambles text. Caesar cipher shifts letters forward by a fixed amount. Hello with a plus three shifts becomes Rot13, a Caesar cipher with a fixed shift of 13. This is usually used in old internet forms. Hello in this instance becomes Visionaire cipher. This one uses a keyword to shift each letter differently. It's way harder to brute force. For example, the text attack, the keyword key. This is used in historical war communications and early military code. Steganometry. This is where it gets sneaky. Instead of scrambling data, we hide it inside something else. You can use this in images. You can hide messages inside pixel data, often using the least significant bits. This can be used to hide spyware, malware, and even covert messages. You can do the same thing when it comes to audio. Audio gets buried in audio signals. You can't hear it, but it's there. Think secret messages in songs or even Morse code in music. And this is where it gets really interesting. You can hide it in plain text. You can have extra spaces, zeros with characters, or even capitalization patterns. For example, this message looks normal, may not be normal, and actually might have some hidden spaces the only the computer can see, but not you. Not every message is digital. Some methods are timeless. An example of that would be Morse code. It could use dots and dashes to represent letters. You can use radio, flashing lights, beeping sounds, and or just dots. A binary code. Everything boils down to ones and zeros. For example, hello is, you can find this in payloads, exploit scripts, and steganography letters. And that's it for this video. This gives you the real bare bone basics and an easy, simple way to understand. If you want to support the channel, please leave a like and subscribe and become a channel member. It really does help. Now remember, safety is an illusion. I'll see you guys in the next video.